Smart meters and mold and what you need to know about these detrimental elements. When I had mold in my house from 2010 to 2013 in Santa Monica, a beautiful penthouse, walked in, painted new walls. It was all hot during the summer. But later on, we discovered that there were mold behind the walls. At the same time, this is when the advent of smart meters came about. And I had five smart meters on the back of my living room wall. When I did the research, I found Dr. D. Dietrich Klinghart. He's one of the foremost doctors when it comes to autoimmune, Lyme disease, autism, things that are really hard to heal. He did research and he witnessed mold growth at 600% when just the ambient Wi-Fi was in the room. They put a Faraday cage over it and the growth stopped. Wi-Fi, electrical fields, microwave radiation exacerbates mold. Make sure that that you don't have mold in your house and cell phone towers and cell phone radiation and radiation in general exacerbates the situation. So be very wise in your living environment and if you're sick or someone you know that is sick, make sure that their environment is not poisoning them.